Hello friends and welcome back to the horror section. This is going to be a pickups video just showing you a few things I picked up since my last video. So here we go. Starting off first with a movie called Night Screams. It looks kind of like a 1980s slasher movie. I kind of watched the trailer and it looked pretty good. I don't really know that much about it. I think IMDB said it was like a couple killers are going around killing a few young kids or something. You know, a few like teenagers. But uh, I thought it might be pretty good, but I've just never seen it. But it's from I Image Entertainment. And usually they put out kind of good, you know, stuff. Their DVDs are a little older, which that makes it kind of cool, you know, finding them and stuff. But I uh, don't really know that much about this one. I'm hoping it'll be good. But uh, I like the cover to it. It looks pretty cool. But like I said, I've just never heard of it. So, like I said, if you know anything about it, please leave it in the comments. Uh, I might have to take this at home and watch it next and kind of do a, uh, might do a, a movie review on it if I kind of like it pretty good. But, uh, that's, uh, Night Screams. Might be pretty good. I picked up another copy of one of my favorite movies, The Mutilator. Good slasher movie from the 80s. And I picked this one up because my buddy, he got two copies for some reason. And his were both uh, sealed in the, uh, come with a slip cover. And mine didn't actually come with a slip cover. So I thought, man, I'll just grab it and get it. And I'll just collect it for the slip cover. I thought that was kind of cool. I've seen this one in stores in the slip cover. But it was always way too much. So I never did get it. And I already had one. But I just wanted the slip cover. And he was willing to trade it. So I grabbed it. But... By sword, by pick, by axe, bye bye, and this is the um, Blu-ray DVD combo from Arrow Video, so it's pretty cool. I actually like that uh, that artwork on the front; it's pretty neat looking. But I just figured I'd grab this one for the slip cover. Like I said, I already had it, but I just wanted to get it with the slip cover and still sealed, so that's pretty cool. So uh, that's the Mutilator. Here's a pretty cool movie I enjoy: Babysitter Wanted. And this isn't like most of your babysitter movies. Like the first 15, 20 minutes sort of are until it, until it gets to a certain point. Then it kind of flips it on its head and you think it's going one way and it'll go a totally different way. But it's kind of fun. I mean, it's a neat one. It's one that's got a lot of twists and turns. You think the person's going to get away and then something else happens and you think something else is going to happen. And something. It's, it's just a cool movie with a lot of twists and turns and fun. I just enjoy it really, really good. And uh, if you can't find this one on uh, Blu-ray or DVD, if you have like, a, you can get the uh, Voodoo app, and they have free movies on there, and this is one of them they have free on there. If it's still on there. Last time I looked, it was. And that's where I watched it the first time uh, was Voodoo. They had Babysitter Wanted on there, and I just didn't know what it was. I heard a little bit about it, and I figured I'd go ahead and watch it, and it was pretty good. It like I said, I thought it was going one way, and then it just flipped it on its head, and it went a totally different way. So that's what I liked about it. But I highly recommend Babysitter Wanted. It's pretty cool. Uh, this one's called The Nameless, and it's pretty cool. I've had this on DVD, but I grabbed it on Blu-ray. It's a uh, Miramax, and it's put out by Echo Bridge. And a lot of their stuff is kind of hard to find sometimes, so I figured I'd better grab it. It kind of tells the story of this lady that her daughter was supposedly brutally killed. And so many years later, like four or five years later, she gets a phone call, I believe, from a person saying that, that that's her, that, that it's her daughter and she wasn't actually killed. But the, the nameless, that's why I think that's why she phrases it in the nameless. They, uh, they wanted her, her mother to think that she was dead. And so it's kind of like her mother's trying to figure out what's going on, all the out, the ins and outs of this. You know, is this really my daughter? Is something going on? Is what can I do to? So it's a pretty wild movie. It's kind of creepy, kind of, kind of sinister and stuff. I like it pretty good though. This is one. It's kind of a, it's a little bit of a slower movie, but it's kind of cool to watch. I mean, I like it pretty good. Like I said, I think you can buy get this most of the time on those budget movies where they got. 10 movies on there so check inside in like a used store and you'll probably find one of these with a bunch of other movies and stuff but um, i enjoy it that's the nameless and last but not least 
is uh, the sleeper on Blu-ray on this special edition, collector's edition Blu-ray with all the signatures here. I thought that was cool. It's got the director's signature and I believe an actress and um, I forget what the other guy is. It's got a couple of uh, signatures on it. I thought that was pretty cool, but uh, I really enjoy this movie. I have fun with it, but it's just, it just a cool like throwback slasher movie. It kind of looks like it's made in the 80s, but it's actually made in like 2012, maybe released in 2013. And uh, I really enjoy it. It's kind of a fun one. I even like the uh, little setup right here. The nice picture on the front. The uh, just looks cool. And it also, I got this signed, which uh, you can kind of see in the signatures a little better. And then I also got, if you'll give me a second, something else with it. So wait just a second. Here we go. And then it also come in with this cool poster that's also signed. So I thought that was pretty neat. It kind of looks like an old school poster like you'd have a, like in a video store. It says, if I die before I wake, if I die before I wake, if I die before I wake. So that's pretty cool. And there's kind of the uh, scary slasher guy. You can see the bottom down here. A Gamma Knife Films production. Pretty cool. Yeah, I thought this was a really good movie. And then ScreamTeamReleasing.com is who put it out. Fixed it up on this nice Blu-ray and all that. And you can also get like a VHS copy, I believe, of this and some other stuff. It also comes with a free download of, I guess, the soundtrack, which I've downloaded that to, to my phone. I've not listened to it, but I've just kind of downloaded it. That's all it said was free... Uh, like the soundtrack, it might have other stuff. I've not even opened it up to check on it. I've just downloaded it. But uh, I thought it was pretty cool. I thought it was a really cool, uh, really cool item to get. But like I said, that's a uh, that's pretty much what I've got this week, or since my last video. It's kind of short, but I thought didn't get I didn't get as much stuff. But I thought this right here would make a good video, just showing all this to some of the some of the cool stuff that I picked up so until my next video uh, have a good one see y'all guys bye Zoom.